everyone welcome back to my channel I hope you're all doing so well so today I'm going in with a nice little cute spring set um, she's come in she's I've prepped all her nails and I've applied the almond tips by CJP the pre-pinched ones and I've cut them down to a small coffin shape and I'm just going in with sorry it went off camera a little bit on this finger guys uh, I am going in with I think I went in with milky pink yeah it is it's milky pink by CJP on the middle finger sorry that you can't see I then go in oh also guys before I do apply all the colour I have gone in I think I have already gone in with clear nope I'm going in with clear now so this is crystal glass by CJP and I put this on all the nails just a thin layer just so that I've got something to file back to when she does come back for a redesign I'm using my Liz Guild brush from CJP2. I do wish I'd have used a size 10 for her nails as she has got quite small nail beds. So I'm going in on the thumb with the milky pink again as I'm going to do an ombre. And the purple that I'm using is Decadent Dubai by uh, Nova Nails. I can't remember where I got this from uh, but I'll try and find out where I got it from so I got the decadent Dubai and I mixed it with Snow White by CJP because we needed like a lilac a lilac -y colour than the deep decadent Dubai as how as it is really really dark so we just lightened it by adding white to it and it was the exact colour that she wanted so as you can see as I have mixed it myself it goes a little bit marbly so I have to try and sort that out but it's an easy thing to sort if it is too bad just flip your bead onto the nail when you do place it down that way your marble will be underneath and not on the top so on the fourth finger I'm going in with the purple mix that I made I did this design quite a few weeks ago as I haven't really uploaded, uploaded any videos for the past couple of weeks as I have had some personal problems but I'm not going to bore you with all that stuff so onto the pointy finger I'm going in with the purple mix again this is like a surprise to me as well watching this video because I can't remember the design that I did it's been that long ago since I did it so I'm just I'm just trying to work out as it's going it turned out a really nice purple as well the colour I really liked it the pink and the purple go together so nice as well so I'm going in with the purple here to make the ombre it's the first time using a colour like this on the ombre came out okay after that has set I do go back in with crystal glass to cap it oh I'm just going back in with some milky pink just there just to make that blend a little bit better I think yeah so then I just go back in with crystal glass after it's set just so that when I come to do the filing I don't file into that blend 
Now, I have noticed watching the videos back of myself doing nails, I do faff a lot. And if my auntie is watching this, she will also be thinking the exact same thing as I did her nails a couple of weeks ago and she just has extensions with nude on because she puts her own colour on. And I did a mare for she was going away for the weekend. And I noticed then how much I faffed <laughs> and she said to me, stop faffing. So if she is watching this, she'll probably be laughing knowing how much I'm faffing about. <laughs> So on the little finger I'm going in with Angel Wings by CJP. I absolutely love this glitter, it's so beautiful. And I do a full nail of that. Yeah, I think I thought I did. I then go in the middle finger and do like a little fade from the top downwards with the angel wings. And because there's small chunks and bigger chunks in this, it's easier to blend down as well. Then after that, I am now going in with crystal glass to cap the nails as it also is a glitter acrylic just make sure that the glitter turns matte and then you know you've capped everything there's nothing worse than leaving a little bit bare and then going in filing and you file away the glitter so the same on them all apply the bead at the cuticle pull it down and drag it down and try to make the apex as you go if not just add another little bead and blend it up and I do this on all the nails After I've done all that then I will go in, file and buff the nails. Then I will go in with CJP's top gloss, put in the lamp for 60 seconds. And then once I've done that I will let the nails dry for at least 60 seconds. Then apply my cuticle oil which is also, I think it's called Flower Blast from CJP as well. And I've left a little clip at the end as well just to show people how hard it is to try and get a good photo. <laughs> how you have to move about the fingers to try and get a good photo. I just thought I'd leave it in just to have a little laugh at the end. I've also left a clip at the end of the finished design. If you haven't already please subscribe, like the video and leave a comment. I would love it if you would also nip over to my Instagram page and give me a follow. I've got plenty of designs on there as well. And yeah, so I hope you're all having a good day and I will speak to you all soon. Bye!